Log 2302's main purpose is to investigate, report, and remediate any system that sits internally to a government network and is accessible through public internet. Exceptions to this BOD are things like public facing web servers. Exonius can simplify this BOD by giving admins data points from multiple tools. For example, let's start with the simplest high risk systems, those that have a public IP. Here you can use the query wizard to search for any IP subnet that's not private. And we'll drop our non-private subnets here. Now that I've found these systems, I can then create a tag that will tag the systems as a public IP. If I wanted to get more granular, and let's say go through a cloud provider, I could go directly into something like AWS and pull any system that has a public IP that exists. I could then further execute that EC action and add those public tags to these as well. Now the BOD wants to get very granular in reporting of ports that may be open or services that may be using the public facing internet that can be hit from externally. To get more granularity of this, Exonius connects and ingests all the data from all of these tools and services. We could then, for example, bring in data from vulnerability scanners such as Qualys or Tenable that may do an unauthenticated scan that show these ports that are open to public internet. We can even enrich these devices with services such as Shodan. The true power of Exonius is bringing in data from existing infrastructure and tools and then correlating it together.